Thanks for joining me today on Let's Build a Look. In today's episode, we'll learn how to take an S-Log 3 shot and create a Fight Club inspired look. All right, so this one we have a S-Log 3 shot. We're gonna aim for a grade that's similar to the Fight Club, like greenish yellow look. Seems like the majority of stuff here, we have some, I think these were LED lights. And then in the back, we have the old school tungsten yellow lights. Okay, so the first thing that we're gonna do, we're gonna come over here to Open FX, and we're going to do a color space transform. Uh, we're going down to, uh, S gamma and then we're going down to S low three and then in the target color space or output we are going with Ari <clears throat> and C log so then we got this shot now the end of this we are going to come into our LUTs and we're going to grab the C log to 709 which lands us right about here. On this side, there's a big uh, LED like uh, screen that's outside. So that periodically lights up. So that's why the blue was so crazy over there. So going back, we're gonna make a node before. To do that, you're gonna hit Shift S for series node before. You can also right click, go into add node, series node before. So in this one, we're going to start adding our colors that we want to affect this shot so the first thing that we're going to do in our mids we're going to add a lime color to start with and we'll play that through and see what we how we're looking so far okay we might be able to push that lime uh, a little stronger something like that and let's look in these headlights Right now we're moving our high point and that's where these controls affect. So if you look over here, as I move my high point, it's going to affect the, the top half and that's stating where this one uh, interacts with this one. So that's our high point. And the idea here is that we want to have the green affect the majority of the shot, but we don't want it to affect these lights so much. Uh, we will almost want to throw a yellow into the mix up there so i'll add a little more yellow and we can get an idea here and you'll start to see them blend so we want to watch for that i'm picking our high point and then also we want to do on the opposite side of that our low where our low connects with the and for this one we're going to go with a darker green Okay, you can also look in the sky for where this is happening. So I'm gonna go with that area and we're actually not even going to, uh, let's pull some of this red out. So we're gonna go blue a little bit, pull some of that red out of the, the sky up there. All right, so we have this so far. We're gonna add another series node. And for this node, I'm going to pull a little more, I wanna pull a little more yellow and get a different uh, high point. So we're gonna go kind of heavy on the yellow here. All right. <clears throat> gonna affect that high point. See, we can get to go yellow and then move that yellow up so we're just really affecting these lights i feel like that is a pretty good spot let's full screen this and see where we're at so far okay so far so good what i want to do next is i really want to change the yellow on these lights out here I want to add a little more orange into them <clears throat> so we're gonna come into Huber's hue and we're gonna grab some of this we're gonna see if we can push that a little on the orange side 
So I would say something of that nature. That's almost a little too much red. Just a little do it. We'll do it for you. Alrighty. And then we're also going to come into the Luma curve for that as well. And we're going to bring it down just a little bit. And we're also going to go into saturation for that yellow. And we're going to pull it up just a little. Don't want to overdo it. All right. So how are we looking so far? It's full screen this off on. Okay. So now we have pretty good colors. Not bad where we start it, where we're at currently. If we wanted, we could come back and we could add <clears throat> just a tad more green. And just don't want to go too far. That's not looking bad. All right, so then after the node, what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to go into a different color space. We're going to go into the lab color space. And the reason why I'm going into lab is because the L channel, we can specifically just work with the luminance values of things and not shift colors at all. Okay, so we're going to come into our curves and we're just going to work with red because that's the luminance channel. If we move this, we only affect luminance. We don't affect color in any way. And then we're going to throw a little bit of an S curve in here and add more of a moody look to this. How are we looking so far? Not too bad. Not too bad. Let's see how that shot looks now. Throw it on a loop. I, I'm, I'm actually pretty happy with how this looks. <clears throat> I don't know if there's much I would change. The, um, I don't know if you can see the edges of this um, yellow that we added. There's almost a little red in there. But I'm pretty happy with how this looks. So where we start it and uh, where we ended up. And let's go quickly through what we did <clears throat> one last time. We'll clean up the node graph. We'll close this. First, we came in with a transform. So we went from the S log to Alexa uh, C log. And then we did our color shift of a little bit of um, lime. And then we also wanted to get the red out of the shadows. So we came a little on the uh, cyan. And we also added a tad of orange into there. And that red might actually be that, that mix right in here. Then jumping over to our second one, we just added a little more and we changed where the high point is for that. And then jumping over to this for this one, we went in and we changed the um, orange in the background to make those look more like a tungsten ball instead of that weird yellow that you get out of the Sony cameras. Then we have our C log conversion uh, to Rec 709. And then at the end of this, we have our going into LAB and affecting the lumen values of the whole grade. And that's the look for today. More of a fight club, green, yellow-ish. And uh, I'm pretty happy with, with the results out of this one. So yeah, that's all for today. Check back tomorrow for another build a look. Again, my name's JR, and I'll see you then.